I want to show you the best way to import a budget into analytical accounting in Dynamics GP. The first thing you want to do is go to the financial area page here and then click on budget under cards. That brings up the analytical accounting budget maintenance screen. Look up a budget or type a new budget in. So I've got this existing budget. So if I didn't have a budget in here already, all I would do is hit export to export the budget to Excel. Let's just do that. I'm going to create a new worksheet. And this is what it looks like in Excel. In my system, I have two dimensions in analytical accounting. I've got a project and I've got a cost type. So you can see the projects listed here. You can see the different cost type values listed here. And then in periods one, two, and three and on, I've got the budgets for those different dimensions. So the thing to know is you have to supply the subtotals for the dimensions and then total for the entire budget for that particular period. This is an existing budget in analytical accounting. If I did not have a budget in there, I just named a new budget and I was going to create one. What I could do is export a blank Excel spreadsheet. It would have all the dimensions listed. And all I would have to do is put in the budget amounts for the period of time for the different dimensions. But I had to also have to manually apply the subtotals, enter those subtotals, and then the total for the whole thing. Once you've got that done, all you need to do is import it back into analytical accounting. And that's easy to do. To import it back in, all you need to do is hit import in this screen, look for the file, select the worksheet, hit OK. It's going to import that information into analytical accounting, and now I can use it in the screens in GP. I can also use it in Management Reporter.